The book Fire by Kristen Cashore takes place in a kingdom called Dells. In this land, monster versions of all animal species are vividly colored and have a mesmerizing appearance. The protagonist is a beautiful human monster named Fire, who also has the power to implant thoughts and emotions into others' minds. For most of her life, Fire has lived on a manor with Lord Brocker and his son Archer. Though her father Canswell loved her and visited her often, he was also a cruel man who used his beautiful monster appearance and his mind control abilities to manipulate others and gain power. His death occurs a few years before the start of the novel. Fire is constantly burdened by the fear that she is evil like her father, and as a result, she hides her beauty and avoids using her powers. Despite her loyalty, bravery, and fierce independence, she's an outcast in the kingdom. She often wishes that the kind and compassionate Lord Brocker was her biological father instead. The kingdom is now on the brink of war. Lawlessness abounds and rebel lords have built armies to try and take over the crown. Prince Brigan comes to Fire and asks for her help in uncovering the plot against the king. Fire is hesitant about this because it would involve using her mind control powers to interrogate captured spies. As political tension mounts, Fire must discover how to use her powers for good, build trust with those around her, and escape from the evil shadow of her father.